What was the worst job interview you've had? Not a recruiter, but I am a restaurant manager. We were opening a new location and doing interviews. Woman comes in for a management position. During the interview, she reaches into her purse and pulls out a bag from Wendy's and starts eating. The other manager tells her to put it away and she tells him it is okay, she can multitask. I once sat in on an interviewer's debrief for a large organization where you need professional skills. They were open to recruiting internally for a new position at a higher level, so a few people already in the organization at a slightly lower level applied and were interviewed that day. One candidate performed so poorly in the interview and demonstrated such a severe lack of skill, not only did she not get the new position, they decided to have a private meeting about whether or not to fire her from the job she already had. That was in my view, a really terrible interview. HR director here. Here is a few over the years. Was told to give an interview for a manager position for some girl right out of college. Could tell it was someone pulling strings because she had no experience in the field and her degree was in criminal justice. This was an IT position. Had a guy with a killer resume, all the credentials, come in for an interview. Though it was going to go well, he instead was drunk and high. He couldn't even string a full sentence together. Had a woman go ballistic on me when I asked her about her career goals. I thought I was on an episode of Punked. Best one was calling a reference a guy had left for me, yes yeah, stands a nice guy, shows up on time, keeps to himself. If you need someone to warm a chair for 8 hours a day, he is your guy. If you want someone to do a little more work, I got a cinder block here that's a little more motivated. Not in HR, but had to interview a bunch of people for several roles. I have so many stories, but I think I'll go with the most idiotic. Unprompted, the guy talked about how he went to a contractor and saw them mixing this white powder, and the contractor insisted it was the best glue ever. He was skeptical at first, but then saw the results and was amazed. He had to find out the name of the glue immediately, and it was our brand. It was fate that the recruitment agency offered him a job with us. Our glue is a powder glue, but it doesn't come in white. It's a brown powder. You can even see it in the videos all over the website. I was tempted to pick the guy who sent me this as the worst, but TBH, his actual interview must have been unmemorable because I don't remember him at all. Was interviewing an internal candidate for a position in a parallel department. I was embarrassed for him he seemed to think he had the job in the bag, and so came totally unprepared and behaved so arrogantly that it was frankly shocking. He failed to silence his phone, it rang four times before he excused himself to silence it, and proceeded to grill us on other candidates during his do you have any questions for us? Portion. He had dropped by the desk of a co-worker the day before the interview and threatened her, you know, I hope this interview goes well, I've got dirt on you all. He played it off as a joke, but his wife was our boss. He'd been hired as a favor to her for a job he wasn't suited for, was trying to parlay the limited experience he'd gotten into this higher level position, and was so confident in her ability to push this for him that I took particular relish when alternate hiring decisions were made. She'd also clearly fed him info about the role and written his resume slash cover letter for him, and was in a snit herself with the hiring manager for passing him over. Not an HR recruiter, but at my wife's company three dudes left with a stolen customer list and tried to start a company in direct competition with the wife's company. One of the dudes was supposed to bankroll the new company, but he couldn't come up with the cash, so the other two dudes dumped him. The dumped dude tried interviewing with the wife's company to try to get his job back. I work in a financial institution. I had a person say that they cannot work more than four hours a day and only Monday, Wednesday and Friday. She did not want to interfere with her welfare benefits. She also asked what we do if there is cash missing at the end of a shift. <laughs>